I'm back here again with another guitar tutorial from a new one, Anson Sebra. Uh, if this video helps you out, I hope you'll like, subscribe, and let me know other songs uh, that you want to learn on guitar. Uh, Anson reminds me of like a young Ben Folds 5 meets Fionn Regan, uh, who you probably have never heard of, um, but was a Mercury Prize, I think, nominee. I don't know if he was a winner. Uh, this is like way back, like uh, 2007, 8, maybe? 6? It's been a while. Um, but his style reminds me of, of both of those uh, singer-songwriters put together, which is really cool, and it definitely drew me in right away uh, as his... Uh, bio says on Spotify, draws uh, listeners in magically. Uh, so this is a song called Somewhere in Ann Arbor. It's super easy. If this video helps you out, like and subscribe. Um, we're going to just really be doing basically downstrokes. You can put in a little upstroke there on, on like the, the changing of your chords. So you can go, you know, like we'll start on C down up G, right? And that could be like a cue for yourself as well. Hey, we got a chord change, right? So you only need to know four chords, which is even better. You got C, okay, uh, 032010. We're gonna go to G, uh, 320003. We're gonna go to A minor, 002210. And then F, which I'm doing as a bar chord just to give it a little bit more of that. Mm. But you could also do, uh, sorry, bar chord is one three three two one one. but you could also do 0, 3, 3, 2, 1, 1, or 0, 0, 3, 2, 1, 1. Just know that it's going to be a little bit more kind of um, higher on the register than we probably would, would care for for this song, especially because it's a little bit more kind of brooding. All right. Uh, so classic chord progression here. C, 2, 3, 4 to G. Right? To A minor. To F. Somewhere in Arbor, there's a da 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 da. Right? Okay. When we get to the chorus, it's going to change the, the chord progression, but you're going to still use the same four chords. So instead, you'll go F. Oh, he's got it good. Right? To C to G, to A minor, F, to C, to G, to A minor, okay? So if you go back to C, G, A minor, F, all right, for, uh, the, for the next part. So you do those, those two things twice. Uh, and then you're gonna do this little kind of bridgey interlude. It's gonna go, a minor, so we go A minor, one, two, three, four, G, one, two, three, four, then F, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, then F, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, C, I think it's C to G, uh, and then it goes, uh, then it goes again, A minor, G, F, So the first time you're going to put in a C to G, and then the second time it's just going to go to G and hang on G. Okay, and then it goes back to the chorus. So to, instead of going to C, G, A minor, F, it's going to go to that F. He's got it good, C minor, or sorry, C to G to A minor, okay? Uh, and I think, I think that plays it out, and then I think we end on C from what I remember, but um, you'll hear it. I think you'll be able to recognize what chord it is and be should be fine. So no worries there, um, but I really like the song. I'm gonna check out some more of uh, Anson's work uh, and you let me know other Anson songs you wanna learn on guitar. Um, you can do that down below. Uh, while you're there, shoot me a like, let me know how you like this video and uh, yeah. You can subscribe right here and check out some other videos down here. And thanks for watching. Hope you're staying safe. And I hope to see you again soon. Bye.